I'm not a mess. I'm not a mess. Made to rest. I'm not a mess. What's up y'all, it's King KB back here with another video and today I will be explaining 5 ways that I got to over 500 subs in less than 3 months. Now I know it might sound like crazy, like I'm cheating, like it's some type of gimmick, but for real, you can check, I just started getting serious on YouTube at the beginning of this year and it's only March, so it's really been less than, yeah, it's been less than 3 months. So. The first, let's get, let's get on with the video. So the first thing on this list is you gotta advertise yourself. You gotta make sure everyone you know knows that you got a YouTube channel and that you're trying to do big things. I and mean, now, this doesn't only apply to if you do a YouTube channel. If you were trying to blow up on Instagram or anything like that, then you gotta let people know. You gotta let people know that know you so they can support you. So this starts off with like posting your links and stuff on your social media that you already have like i know all y'all got an instagram and stuff like that so share your stuff on those type of platforms so that people can know what you're doing and start following you now second on this list is join some communities online now this is something that a lot of people don't really get active with and don't think really works but it's kind of like you got to be active in the community you can't just pop up first day in the community and be like hey i got a youtube channel check me out like no nobody's gonna listen to you nobody's gonna watch your stuff nobody like we don't even know you why would i go check you out so you got to be active in the community for a little bit and then you can start push, pushing your stuff out there after a little while because you don't want to come in there and the only reason you're there in the community is for clout you got to support other people so they can support you and there's a lot of communities out there that you can look at um on different I'm types of media like oh, there's a lot of facebook communities you can find that help like small youtubers and stuff like that there's also reddit communities now reddit to me is the best way to do this because there's a lot of subreddits and things that you can find where you can share your stuff and not only can you just search for like youtube but you can also search for like specific genres on youtube list. and find that subreddit that's just for you Let's so go. you can find your community and spread it's the word like that day. now number three on this list is something that might cost a little money everybody won't be able to do this but hey, you, just, you, you gotta you advertise you yourself your other than your just like your social media you gotta one thing i use is google ads and oh. it's, it usually doesn't cost that much but like if, even if you pay for oh, a decent amount of ads right, for like a day or two days maybe a week you can watch your subs grow exponentially I promise you that's one of the main ways that I got to over 500 subs and it's pretty simple you just search up the uh, Google ad like you just search it up and it kind of walks you through it it's a pretty simple process so yeah that's number three on my list number four is consistency now consistency is key because not only do you have to get people to come to your channel using the other ways I just mentioned but you also have to keep people coming back to your channel. You gotta provide content consistently and quality. So, like, that's one thing I've had trouble with, I'm not even gonna lie. Like, I have trouble with consistency. I, sometimes it takes me a while to get a video out, I'll get caught up doing other stuff and I just don't record the video, but consistency, for real, is key, I promise you. Consistency is key try if you can try to push out at least two to three videos a week starting out i mean if you can push out a video a day push out a video a day like i promise you and keep consistent with the content that you're sharing like keep to a certain like you can't just go like, like you can't vlog and then do a gaming video and just like same like it's not it's not the same thing like all right so unless it's just like the type of channel you're going for i guess you're just going i mean i don't know but like you just try to be consistent because the people who subscribe to you for doing this one thing aren't going to want to watch this other thing just as much. You get what I'm saying? So you got to be consistent with your content and find out what gets you the most views and what you enjoy the most recording. So that's really important. Now, I have an extra. So this is where it gets to five. So this is something that I'm going to start doing right now. I'm just, I've created some uh, 
social medias that I'm gonna start growing. So you have to make your own social media accounts for those for your platform for your YouTube platform that coincide with that. So where that those certain social medias are interacting with your audience, they're out here like promoting your stuff, telling people what's coming up, you know, being in contact with your subscribers and the people that follow you and just being active overall that's like really important so that's something i'm just starting to do now and that's on my road to 1000 subs so if you want to wait i'll give some more tips on how i get to 1000 and i'm counting i'm i'm calling i'll get to 1000 in another three months less than another i bet i get to 1k in two months we'll see we'll see we'll see but you gotta stay tuned you gotta subscribe like the video and spread the word so that way we can get all these tips out. Thank you everybody. Peace out. King KB.